Well, CNN's at it again. Yeah. They're about to launch a new streaming service that's going to show exclusive content that you can't get anywhere else. We fixed the glitch. <laughs> for just $4 a month. You're a fucking idiot. I'm Jasper Gonzo and this. Wasn't this tried a few years ago? Yes! Yes! You know, with CNN Plus and it cratered because of shitty content. That is true! That no one wanted to watch and no one gave a fuck about. That is also true! Yes. <laughs> God! You can't make this shit up! Are you serious? And it's what's next. Hey, happy Thursday, ladies and gentlemen. Jazz Berganza, what's next? Your daily dose. Hope you guys are feeling good today. Well, they're at it again. Who am I talking about? Well, it could be a number of people, a number of things, but we're just going to focus on one. And that would be one CNN. Yes, the Cuck News Network or the Clinton News Network, you know, full of lies, lies, and more lies and bullshittery. They got something new. Wait for it. Just wait for it. They're about to launch a new streaming service, exclusive content. Can't see it anywhere else for just $4 a month. You excited for that? How do you like that? Well, why does this sound familiar? That we've been down this road before. Oh, yes, we have been. CNN plus anyone. The cratered streaming service. They got a bunch of people fired because it was shitty. But, got to give them points. They're trying again. And here we go. This comes out of the Gateway Pundit. CNN launching paywall, expecting consumers to pay for content that no one wants to watch for free. Ratings challenge CNN is preparing to launch a paywall for their content. What could possibly go wrong? Well, remember back in 22, let's go in the Wayback Machine, when CNN streaming service CNN Plus flopped before it got off the ground, are they going to call this CNN Plus Plus? CNN resident Potato, uh, Brian, yes, the little eunuch himself, yeah, yeah, sadly he's back, Stunner, announced on his X page, uh, this will help foot the bill for CNN's journalism. Quote, big news about CNN today. CNN's website, one of the most popular sites in the world, I don't know what the fuck he's watching. Anyway, it's starting to ask some users to pay $3.99 a month for access, laying foot for the first bricks in a paywall that should over time help foot the bill for CNN's faux journalism. Because no one actually knows what the they're doing over there. CNN has rolled out a paywall and asking some of its consumers to pay $3.99 a month for access for its content, a news website said on Tuesday as it looks to generate a digital revenue stream. The move comes at a time with several publications such as the New York Times opens a new tab has already launched uh, and success with subscription models that have helped boost subscriber numbers with cable television viewership and revenue dwindling news organizations such as CNN are looking to cash in on digital media to offset the decline in TV, which has previously been a key source of its revenue. Starting today, we're asking users in the United States to pay a small recurring fee, small, not much, small opens a new tab for unlimited access to cnn.com world-class articles said access uh said alex mccallum cnn's executive res vice president and digital products of services will you be signing up to pay for cnn's hard-hitting journalism one x user this will be a massive failure for cnn yes nothing but laughs exactly it will be fascinating to see how long this lasts how to throw something silly in there. You know, how to do silly story after coming off the last serious one. But again, you got to give credit to CNN for trying. They're trying. They're trying really hard because no one gives up about them anymore. You know, they're like the redheaded stepchild. They don't give a shit. No one cares. You know, CNN was at, was at its apex when they fired Don Lemon, Cuomo, and the little eunuch. That's when CNN was at its best. That was Masterpiece Theater when they were uh, getting rid of these clowns. And then, of course, you know, Don Lemon's got his, uh, you know, YouTube, uh, you know, YouTube, whatever he's doing over there. No one watches. And, uh, of course, Chris Cuomo's on um, uh, Newsmax. So some people are watching. And, of course, the little Unix back at CNN where no one is watching. So since no one is watching, I got an idea, says the vice president. Let's launch another streaming service. 
But I'm sure there had to be somebody in that room, at that table, during that meeting, saying, we've been there on this road before. We've tried this with CNN Plus, and it tanked. It tanked. Why are we doing this again? Vice President, well, things are different now. You know, that was a few years ago. You know, people weren't ready for the hard-hitting journalism that is CNN. But they're ready for it now. And at four bucks a month, you can't pass up on it, right? Yeah, I guess that makes sense. Anyway, it's going to be a joy to see how long this lasts. Because CNN Plus, I think, lasted a month before it cratered. So you got 30 days, CNN Plus Plus. 30 days. It's a fucking joke. <laughs> but anyway, with that being said, I'm Jazz Borgonzo. This is what's next. Want to see more like this? Please leave a comment below. Like it, share, subscribe to it, hit that notification bell so you guys never miss a thing. Continue spreading the word about the show. Appreciate you guys watching as always, and we'll catch you next time. Peace.